So on an RXV for your 48 volt, 12 volt reducer, uh, you have to, the blue wire on the reducer has to have what's called trigger power. Uh, a lot of carts you'll get that from the key switch. The RXV is not uh, in that category. So you don't want to be splicing into a key switch of RXV. The, that's just not best practice. Instead, what you want to do is take off the cover for your controller. You can see here's your solenoid. Uh, that's, this is your main positive battery cable. It goes over to the Rhino. And then if you look on the opposite side of the controller, you have this bar here. This is switched 48 volt power. So switch on, this becomes energized. Switch off, it becomes de-energized. So that's what will activate your reducer. So what you do is take a 10 millimeter socket, take this bolt out, um, put the blue wire off your Rhino reducer on there, put your white wire back, put your bolt back in, you're good to go. That's where you get your trigger power from for your reducer.